Yo, listen, let me talk. Let me talk. Let me talk. Hot box with knocks. We gon' hot box with knocks. We gon' hot box with knocks. What's up, knocks? You got that green? You got that sour? That blue drink? We call it power. Ooh, wait. That shit got loud. This all I need. I ain't fucking with that power. It's power hour, time to preach to these niggas. I got a few lessons I gotta teach to you niggas. Fuck that bark, only raw worth the spit of Let's get everybody. We back at it. High box with Knox. We in this thing. Man, sorry for the wait. You know, niggas gotta niggas gotta level up one time. But uh today we got a special guest in the in the box, the lovely Miss Melania Monroe. Say what hello to the people. <laughs> <laughs> Hashtag Queen of the Ink Pen. Mm-hmm. Tell them what it is. Tell them what it is. So let's get right into it. Uh, tell the people, you know, what, what you're doing and where you're from and all that good stuff. I'm from L.A. I'm a female rapper. I'm more than a rapper, though. Like, I'm an MC. Tell I them. write all my own shit. I act. What else? I like to make a woman, people a woman, laugh. A woman of many <laughs> trades. A woman of many trades. You like to make people laugh. That's yeah. cool. That's cool. So how long you been, uh, you know, doing your MC and, and your rapping thing? Believe it or not, since I was seven. Since you were seven? Yes. Wow. And, how, and what was your first couple of rhymes? What was your first You know, bars? I wish I remember. My mom has this VHS, and, mm -hmm. like, I'm still trying to get her to look through them because, like, they don't have no titles. But once I see that, then I'll be able to tell you what I was thinking at seven because right. I don't okay. know what the fuck. But that's cool. That's cool. Uh, what what kind of inspired you to, to start, you know, rapping? Just, I've always, I've been one of those people that internalize everything. So, okay. in order to, like, get it out, I write. Mm, okay. And then just, like, seeing, like, Lil' Kim and Foxy Brown and Eve and stuff, like, on TV at, at a very young age, like, it just gave you, like, this drive to, like, do it. All like, right. Why not? And I was like, not your average, like, little cute little girl. I was mm -hmm. like a tomboy. All right. Yeah, so, I can kind of see that. I can kind of see that. Especially yeah. before how I hear you rap about, okay, that she ain't just no, you know, I mean, I, I'm pretty sure you are a pretty princess, but just in that way, like, <laughs> like you know, you're not just rapping about super girly. So you actually got some, you know, real content in your music. Thank and that's you. And that's what I appreciate for sure. So, you know, tell the people about, you know, the latest project you have out right now. It's not only my latest, but it's my first real project and it's titled 95 i put it out in january a few days after my birthday okay um that's what's up yeah. 95 and how it's spelled out it's like 90 the word and five yep so then you can get down all you know you know google play apple music itunes spotify title all that all that and what's your favorite track off the, off the, off the ep album project whatever people call it these days it's just hard uh, to me <laughs> I have two. Okay. I have Love and Hip Hop and uh, Week. But I love my whole EP though. Uh -huh. Like I listen to every song. All right, all right. Yeah, but those are my favorite. Okay. And how was the recording process? Uh, Woo! Making it? <laughs> um, recording. Okay, for me it wasn't that. Like the bars was not the the hard part. Right. Doing it's a track on there called Ooh Ooh. Uh, you can switch it to Jodeci and Hennessy. It has like an alternate title. Right. Um, but that was like the song where I kind of like I was singing, but not really like singing. Okay. And that was like the song that I had to take the most takes with. All right. Because your girl was struggling with yeah. the vocals. Yeah. And uh, you, you, know just, I mean? you just record at one studio, or I recorded the whole project at one studio in Houston. In Houston. At Baron right. Studios. Hey, shout out to Baron Studio in Houston. Uh, Shout yeah. out to Terrence. He was the engineer. Okay. Sign very, very out. good dude. Very good dude. For sure. Mm -hmm. um, what were some challenges you had just in, in your whole career in general um, as far as being an independent artist and and all that? What, what were some challenges that you faced? Not having the finances and then running into, like, I'm not one of those girls that's like, oh, yeah, you can do this for me? Yeah. I'll fuck with you. Okay. No. So it's like people that want to fuck with you, like like mm -hmm. on some like sex shit. That's oh, the hardest okay. thing, you know what yeah, I mean? And it's like, yeah. nigga, fuck you. So then For I real. can't go, you know what I mean? I can't go and record yeah. what I want when I want. True, true, like, true. Like that was like the hard part. And just kind of like being the underdog everywhere you go. But uh, shit, you know, I know everybody gets munches whether you smoke or not. So, you know, what's some, what's some of your go-to munches? Honey buns. Honey buns. Um, Which kind? The, the hostess ones? No, look, in Houston they got this. Well, no, they got Tasty Cakes out here, too. Taste, at oh, I've seen Tasty Cakes. But cake. it's this other brand called Freshly's or something like that, uh -huh. right? And um, they have those. Those are my two favorite. And I like beef jerky and I like, uh, what is it, hot legs. Hot legs. And hot Cheetos and hot fries. 
Okay. I don't know what else I be eating. I'm trying to eat. I think that's it. That's it. All right, all right. Yeah, anything from Sonic? Mm. Oh, what's your favorite slushy from Sonic? Um, the lemon berry slush with extra mango and extra lemon. Hold on. You just got it. Oh, wow. The sun has come out. We got my fucking ruffles. Flaming hot ruffles. Mm. I'm going to open these. I don't know who they are. I don't really Go for care. it. We in the hot box. We in here faded. We we didn't, we didn't got her some motherfucking flaming hot ruffles. You feel me? That's what's up. Um, but um, shit. I do eat these chips. Can we? Can you bless the people with some bars? Yep. Shout out, you know, SSO. You already know what it is. My niggas in here, still standing out. You can follow us on all social media at SSO LA. <clears throat> Listen. Fluency rigor mortis, syntactically correct. I speak direct with effects, dropping gems that's important. Okay. Pushing black power, feel better than pushing Porsches. Representing live from the monkeys on the porches. Mm -hmm. Verbal stimulation got your eyes wide. This inscription's from the poet, it's horse backing with the torches. Shooting at the cone heads, like where are they going? The code in the code in to enter the fortress. No friction, we're flowing. Cause my voice is golden, got cold all outside. It's just me, I feel tortured. Ashes to the fake friends. I'm calling the Lord up, taxing for the features So please get your dough up I was born ready They wishing for glow ups When I drop this, they gonna slow up when they pull up Second guess themselves, get a job, hang the gloves up I'm bringing hip hop back No more of that rubbish Hey right. Okay, <laughs> okay You feel me? That was hard Thank you That was hard <laughs> <laughs> Thank you. I'm sweating, so I, I hope y'all like that shit. Cause oh, on everything, shit, and that and that's what it's about, man. It's you know, it's real art right here. She she really she really spitting that shit. You know, no this to nobody that's doing other shit, but yeah, no, that was that was some real shit. Just from don't the diss art. me. Ha. <laughs> Just don't she diss coming, me, cause coming. that hand is cold. Ah, I feel it. I feel it. So. And everything. My uh, Instagram is at Melania Morel. My spelling is long. So it's yeah. M-I-L-A-N-I-A-A-M-O-N-R-O-E. That's my Instagram. And then I have a Snapchat. It's Princess Melania. That's how you Perfect. find me. And then my Twitter is Monroe Melania. So it's all my name. You'll be able to find me. And then as far as my EP goes, I need y'all to go cop that because that's how I'm living right now. So look, 95, N-I-N-E-T-Y, and the number 5. On Google Play, Amazon, Spotify, Tidal. I'm supposed to have a Pandora channel, but they fucking me up right now. Damn. So, hey, Pandora, run that check. I don't, yeah, run like Pandora, up. like what's try, that? Try doing. I, I need a Pandora station. I need um, something. Yeah, so go ahead, cop that EP because it's you know it's some music with substance. I really just want to, sure. I want to make I sure that, that I, I show Lauren Hill that she did a good job. Okay. With with teaching us, you feel me? For like sure. I'm not out here on no ho shit. I, I learned something, and that's sure, what I really sure. want to get across. To exactly. Spread mm -hmm. the message. So Shout out so. SSOLA for having me. They had me do Wordplay Wednesday, which was really, really dope. And then now I have Hotbox with Knox. Shout out smoking. RVY. Shout out RVY Productions. <laughs> Your girl got t-shirts. Okay. So cash at me. Venmo me. PayPal me. $25. Got right. you. Got you. Yep. To your doorstep. To you. To your doorstep, and you know what? I wanna, I wanna say happy birthday, Chase. Yeah. I know you're gonna see this. Yeah, I know you're gonna Chase. be happy. I love you so much. Y'all can follow me at Hotbox with Knox or at It's Knox Bro on IG. Um, shit, my name, my nigga's working. SSO, we yo, back at it. Yo, listen, let me talk. Hotbox with Knox. We go Hotbox with Knox. We go Hotbox with Knox. What's up, Knox? You got that green, you got that sour, that blue drink, we call it power. Ooh, that shit got loud. This all I need, I ain't fucking with that power. 
It's power hour, time to preach to these niggas. I got a few lessons I gotta teach to you niggas. But that bark only raws worth the spit and make sure your tree is the pick of the lid. Now, now we break it down or we grind it up. Sometimes I like to have some handy in my cup. Two chicks in the room, go ahead and back it up. Something like a dump truck, got a nigga on stuff. I'm so fucking high, but I'm feeling real good. Used to never smoke, I misunderstood. Had a few lows, the Brody said get high. And you know I wasn't doing shit on a Friday night, so I lied. Light it, 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 light